Hey everyone, this is Squall Snake back with another Game Boy Color Rumble Pack video. Today, I am going to be talking about Perfect Dark. I have a new battery in here so we can talk about the Rumble Pack. And before we get started, I have the instruction manual to this game. Perfect Dark is one of the most feature-rich Game Boy Color games on the system. There's so much packed into this little cartridge it's kind of ridiculous so clearly if the n64 version is probably the version most people played but they did make the game boy color version that has just so many features and one of them is multiplayer so you can link it up with another player and you can play a slew of multiplayer matches and i'll go over that in a second it also, of course, has the rumble feature, which we're really going to be featuring today. And then it even uses the IR communications, so you can unlock multiplayer maps when you go to play multiplayer games. Here's how to play the game, and here is what the game does, and the UI, and how to play, and checking bodies by hitting the select button. This also has a bunch of other modes to play. So the majority of the game is the top-down view, which we'll go over in a second. There's the targeting range, which is a first-person perspective. Door control, which is awful. This is a terrible, not fun, Simon says, awful memorization game that I really don't know why they put it in there. River Crossing Jungle Chase, which is kind of like a Spy Hunter kind of clone. There's an attack on a helicopter, sniper modes. You're going to fight a cyborg, Mink Hunter, Octopus Prime. And then here are the multiple uh, multiplayer games. So it's the first two. You can get a bunch of kills, a time game. There's even Flag Run. You can play a game of air hockey. There's the factory fight with Mink Hunter. There's defense. And then even over here, there's death ball and counter force if you have to save hostages. So there's a lot of multiplayer modes in this. There's a ridiculous amount of multiplayer modes. And that's usually something that most players do not play on Game Boy Color. And then it talks about the Rumble Pack. So there you go. There's the instruction manual. Without further ado, let's pop this game in. Oh, and real quick, the Rumble Pack is just one feature, but it also uses the N64 transfer pack. So if you play the N64 game, you plug this in, you plug this into your controller, you're going to unlock cheats. So I'm not going to go over that in this video, but because I have the transfer pack handy here, I just wanted to mention that that's a really cool feature. Only a few games, Game Boy Color version of Mario Tennis, Mario Golf, Perfect Dark, and then one of the Mickey racing games also took part of the rumble pack feature so let's get into perfect dark here it has a cool intro i'm gonna let this ride and here's the rumble pack it's right up here this is the feature that i really want to kind of talk about today how this works with this specific game as i am covering all game boy color rumble pack games you can check out my channel here I, i've played all of them at this point talking about how the rumble feature works in those specific games and there's your Rare logo. Kind of cool to see an old kind of pixelated Rare logo. And it's dark. It's very dark. It, it talks about the aliens. Just right here alone, just English. You can play it in German. There's all these other languages, but no other UI has an actual map. I think that's just cool. They could have easily just made this a menu to pick, but they didn't. They put a little bit more emphasis on this. So we're going to play this in English, of course. And quickly, we will go over, here's the multiplayer extras, and you can play the targeting range, you can play the door control game, which again sucks, river crossing, jungle chase, the hind attack, sniper mode, the attack on the cyborg, mink hunter, and then back to the targeting range. And we'll keep going down the list, the recon photos, oh, I didn't talk about this, it also uses Game Boy printer, so you can print the facial expressions that happen during the game. So if you click this, obviously I don't have a Game Boy printer hooked up, so I can't print it out, but that's just another feature. I mean, it uses everything. There's your rumble, there's your IR communication option. Let's click on secrets. This version, I don't have everything unlocked yet, but when you beat the game, you unlock more maps and modes for multiplayer. So there's a lot going on here when you just completing the campaign. So let's just jump in real quick to um i will this is we'll just continue where my game left off now where i left off is the beginning of the game and this is still kind of the training segment and again kind of just keep your eye on the rumble up there so what sucks about this training segment 
is it's very tedious. And if you mess up one thing, you have to do it all over again. So I'm gonna get a cut scene here by Carrington. Running makes noise. Walk to sneak past guards. Utilize the walk to sneak up to guards and eliminate them with a single shot from the pistol. So you have to use the pistol, which took me a while to realize because I had my AR rifle on and I was like, why is this not working? So let's see if I can do this quick. Nope, see, so right there alone, even though I was behind him, did not work. So the rumble pack goes off when you shoot or when you get shot. So I wanna highlight that. Let's go back in here, try this again. What sucks is you have to listen to the cutscene again. All right, I'll try to do this one more time. Hopefully you gotta time it just right because they can kind of see you from off screen. Okay, Medic, and there's voices in here. That's another thing I didn't highlight. So here's the horrible decoder game, blue, blue. Okay, got it. That's actually hard. There's a lot of buttons, a lot of taps that you got to do there. All right, so now here is the sniper portion. And if you hit the little girl, yeah, if I would have hit the little girl, it's instant game over, and you got to do it all over again. Wow, we're getting a lot of girls here. Can we get an enemy? No. No. Okay, is my game glitched? There we go. Hit. And then you could reload with the other button. So the rumble is going off, if you notice there at the top of the screen. Every time you shoot, oh, I missed. So you can kind of cheat if you get this sweet spot here. You just have to move left and right versus up and down. So you get these first person segments. There's also another sniper rifle segment, which is like this, but it's just not in a shooting gallery. Man, a lot of hostage, a uh, little girl. Icons here. I think you got to kill 15. Okay, yeah, 13 out of 15. I missed a couple. That's fine. So now I'm going to go up. Now what sucks in this next room is these guards can see you from off screen. So I might get an instant game over. See, there you go. That's so dumb. So there's some horrible level design in this game. But I'm going to go back. So that's the majority of the game is the top down. What I want to play is the extra features real quick and let's just see if is this even unlocked I don't know I can't play a sniper mode okay so here you go sniper and there's a and I got killed so very difficult and the control man there's like it doesn't stop right away. I don't understand how to beat that, but very hard. And let's play real quick the jungle chase. So you can shoot. And the rumble is going off, not when you shoot, but when you take damage or when you bump into something. And I'm dead again. So very hard, as you can see. And we'll play River Crossing. Why not, since we're here? River Crossing, another sniper level. And I think here you just have infinite ammo, so I'm just going to go crazy. You can just hold it down. When you take damage, the rumble goes off, but not when you shoot. So there's, yeah, there's a nice, solid, firm rumble there. I gotta reload now. I don't have any. How do you reload? I can't reload. I got. Oh, you gotta hit the. Okay, that you gotta grab the icons. That's what it is. There's my health. You gotta get the health. I don't have anything. I cannot shoot anymore. It says reload, but I'm still shooting. I'm 
Hit the other button, you can throw grenades. And I'm dead. There you go. So, yeah, very hard. So anyway, that's Perfect Dark. It uses the Rumble Pack. It uses everything else, including the Transfer Pack, multiplayer modes, first-person segments, voice. A lot of stuff here with Perfect Dark. So... Again, this is, I think, the last Game Boy Color Rumble Pack video. Check out all my other Rumble Pack videos and everything else on my channel. You can follow me on Twitter, at Zach Gaz, Z-A-C-K-G-A-Z. And until next time, thank you for watching and game on.